In this video, we're gonna walk you through how to trade on Sin Futures. To begin with, go to sinfutures.com and launch the Beta D app that is located on the top right corner. Then, connect your MetaMask wallet and select the network. In this tutorial, we'll be using Polygon, but all the other networks are available as well. Next, select the base asset and the quote asset. The base asset is the asset you want to trade with whereas the quote asset is the margin asset. For example, if you want to long MATIC, MATIC will be the base asset. Then, select the quote asset from the drop-down menu. In our tutorial, the quoted asset will be USDC. Don't forget to set a maturity date once you've selected the asset. After that, depending on if you want to long or short, click on the long dash buy or short dash sell tab and enter the amount of base asset you want to trade. In this video, we'll be longing for 2 MATIC. The next step is to deposit your margin. The system automatically calculates the margin requirements for different risk levels. You can select the suggested 2x leverage, or you can choose a different risk level of up to 5x by simply putting down the corresponding margin. We'll be using 2x leverage for this video. Click Deposit and confirm the transaction. Please note, you need to have enough margin in your wallet to place the trade. Finally, click Trade and confirm your transaction. That's all you have to do to place an order. Now, you can check your position under Account. To close a position, you'll need to place a trade in the opposite direction. For example, to close the long position we just made on Matic, we'll need to place a short trade. Click the short dash sell tab and input the amount of Matic we just longed, which will be 2 in this case, and then you can click trade. Our Matic position is now closed. Thanks for watching this video, hopefully this will help you trade on Sin Futures.